Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, sorry I haven't made a video in a while. I've just been really busy with like school and other stuff, sports, activities. Just a lot has come up. And um, I know I've kind of let down on the videos a little, but this one is going to be a little bit longer one. And recently, if you viewed my blog or viewed my YouTube, you've seen that I have made a video about how to jailbreak the iPhone and iPod Touch 3.1.3 three or over and iPad as well um, so this video is going to be like a review of my favorite apps for the jailbroken iPhone and iPod touch um, right off the bat as you can see I have a theme and it looks similar to the iPhone OS 4.0 um, the app that I'm using to theme this is Winterboard which I'll scroll down and as you can see I have vertical scrolling which I'll go into in a minute but that little blue icon there is called Winterboard, so I'll open it up. Um, and basically what it allows you to do is theme your device. You can download themes from Cydia after you jailbreak and just theme it to look like anything you want. I have themed mine to look like iPhone OS 4.0, which is pretty cool. So that's all. That's pretty cool. You can customize any aspect of your iPhone or iPod Touch slash iPad. So I would download that if you guys want. It's a free download, so it's worth it. Uh, the second app that I have to show you guys is not really an app, it's just a feature. Um, if you noticed before, I have vertical scrolling, which means I can vertical scroll my, my uh, springboard and also horizontally if you would like. This is a tweak called InfiniBoard from Cydia. And what it basically allows you to do is have an infinite number of icons on your verticals page and as many apps as you want on your iPhone. So you can scroll up and down vertically as well as horizontally and hold a lot more apps. So that's pretty cool, guys. Um, a second one that is similar to this is called Infini Dock. And as you can see, ah, crap, guys, sorry. As you can see, I can scroll my dock left and right and have infinite number of, uh, of apps in the dock as well. So that's called Infinity Dock, and they're both by the same author, Insidia. So I would go ahead and download that if you guys want it, and it's uh, it's free, and it's also pretty cool, guys. So that is an awesome tweak. Um, now one that a lot of you guys are going to enjoy. Let's go ahead and open up a couple apps here. Videos. Let it load up. Let's go music. Let's go. Let's just say Opera. Okay, so now say you have a lot of apps open. I know this has been released in iPhone OS 4.0, but say you want to multitask and you don't have iPhone OS 4.0. How would you do that? Well, this is the solution, guys. There are three apps that you are going to need to download from Cydia. First off is Backgrounder, which allows you to run apps in the background. Second is Circ... I don't know how to pronounce it, but Circuitous... Circuitous, um, C I R C U I T O U S, um, and then this third app you're gonna want to download is Pro Switcher. And now, basically, guys, I'll go through. Backgrounder is self-explanatory; it allows you to run them in the background, so you can't. It's not really that useful, but you can't really do anything with it. I'll go through Pro Switcher first. So now, once you have a lot of apps open, I have configured mine to hold down the home button, and it is multitasking and it comes up with a palm pre style um, interface so as you can see I can scroll through my apps and just switch to them just by clicking I'll do it again switch to music and it leaves it right where it was so you can multitask um, and then you to close out an app just hit the X in the upper right and it scrolls out and now I have no apps running because I exit out of all of them and that's that's how Pro Switcher works, guys. So now, what about Circu Circuitous or whatever it is? Um, this one, Circuitous, is similar to the iPhone OS 4.0 way of multitasking. I've configured mine to double tap the home button. As you can see, a little dock comes up on the right with all your open apps that you can scroll through up and down. So I'll go ahead and click music. And as you can see, it switches out of Opera to music. Um, sorry, guys. I'll go ahead and switch, go back to music, um, double tap, go to videos, and that's how it works guys, it's similar to the iPhone OS 4.0, and if you, I'll exit out of these with Pro Switcher, 
So that's pretty cool, guys. Sorry, low battery. So that's a way of multitasking. That is how you multitask without the iPhone OS 4.0. And it really is worth it. It's a lot of, it's helpful. And you don't need the iPhone OS 4.0. You can do it with any firmware. Um, now, what other apps do I have? Oh, yes. Um, this is a good one. I have vertical scrolling with Infinity Board, so I don't know how useful this would be. But if you have multiple pages of icons, you can download a something called Orbit, which is that little blue, like dark blue and navy blue icon right there. And that allows you to have similar like Springboard Exposé on a Mac, if you know what that is. So I'll click it here. Sorry. And as you can see, it brings up a list of your, of your uh, Springboard pages, and you click it. It brings you directly to that Springboard page. You can switch between them directly, and it's a lot faster. So that's pretty cool, cool guys. It's kind of sim simple, though. Um, another app that I have is the Screen Recorder. Let's go ahead and open it up. All this is, guys, is you click the little red button, it records your screen, similar to like a computer screen recorder. Um, and you can basically show people what you're doing on your iPod. It is a little laggy because it's in beta stages, so I would not recommend uh, downloading this yet. I just wanted to test it out, so that's pretty cool. And finally, guys, that green icon right there is called Installus. Um, I can't show you what I can't like put that on uh, the video because for copyright purposes but that is to download free apps um and the repo is Cydia or repo Cydia dot Haculo dot US and then you can download that and get free apps guys and um yeah so overall those are just a few of the jailbreak apps that I've gotten so far um if you have any questions just leave a comment and rate like like this video it would greatly uh help me out and I would appreciate it and visit my blog also for further updates and don't forget to subscribe for future jailbreak updates so thanks for watching guys overall and I hope you enjoyed this video thanks peace